Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you two different ways you can use the clone tool in GIMP. So I'm going to make sure my clone tool is selected. And I have this airplane here, but I want it to be down here as well to have two airplanes. So I'm going to click and hold the command key on my Mac keyboard. And I'm going to select the front of the airplane. And then I'm going to go down here to where I want the airplane to start. And I'm just going to start drawing. And as you can see, the airplane is copied from the above image to down here where I want it. And I just continue drawing until the full image has transferred. And then I would edit this a little to make it look like the plane is actually down here, like getting rid of some of these dark blue spots. And now there's another use, and I have this picture of Robbie Rotten. And I'm gonna use the clone tool again, and I am going to hold my command key and click right in the middle of his forehead. Also, I'm gonna make sure that his layer is selected first. Click the command key in the middle of his forehead. And then I'm gonna just get rid of his eyebrows. And as you can see, clicking in the middle of his forehead, make sure that it's transferred the skin that's most like what I wanted it to be down here to make it look the most natural. So you can use that to touch up um, skin and also different images that have similar textures and colors. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please leave me a like and subscribe. If you have any questions or requests, please leave them in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching.